Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to discuss about exercise question 4.5 from the chapter 4 Moving Charges and Magnetism of Class 12 Physics. Question is, what is the magnitude of magnetic force per unit length on a wire carrying a current of 8 ampere and making an angle of 30 degree with the direction of a uniform field of 0.15 tesla. So you see, we have a general, see here in this question, there is a current carrying wire which carries some current I equals 8 ampere. Okay, and you see, this current carrying wire makes an angle 30 degree with the direction of the uniform magnetic field of 0.15 tesla. That is magnitude of magnetic field is 0.15 tesla. Then you see this current carrying wire makes an angle. Suppose that angle is theta which is equal to 30 degree with the magnetic field B. Okay. See we want to get an exp we want to get the value of magnetic force per unit length on this wire. See we have this general expression for a force acting on a current carrying wire of length L which is kept in the magnetic field vector B as vector F equals I into vector L cross vector B. Okay, so magnitude of that force is I B L sin theta because vector L cross vector B is L into B into sin theta. So we can write it as I B L sin theta. Okay, so this is the magnitude of the force acting on a current carrying wire of length L kept in the presence of an uh, you know external magnetic field B which makes some angle you this current carrying wire makes some angle theta with the magnetic field theta is the angle between vector L and vector B here we want to get an uh, get the value of magnetic force per unit length that is i am just taking this L to this side that comes to the denominator so force per unit length this is what we want to find out so this will this will be equal to what i into b into sin theta Okay, now we just want to substitute the values. So, this becomes I 8 ampere B 0.15 tesla into sin theta 30. So, this becomes 8 into 0.5 into sin 30 is 1 by 2. 2 4 are 8. So, 4 into 0.15 will be 0 0.60. Okay, this is force per unit length. So, SI unit of force is Newton, SI unit of length is meter, so 0 0.60 Newton per meter or you can write it as 0 0.60 Newton meter raised to minus 1. So, this is the magnitude of magnetic force per unit length on this wire given as per this question. I hope it is clear to you. Thank you.